Let's talk about the elephant in the room. Is Ames Monasia the best among all the new Ames? Well, if you want to know, then watch till the end of this video. In this video, I'll talk about everything that you need to know about Ames Monasia. So let's get this started. For those of you who don't know me, I am Alamin Ashraf, a final year medical student at Ames Vivo Nation. I make videos about tech for students, productivity, time management, health and fitness, and my journey of becoming a doctor. If you like to see them, then subscribe to my channel and ring that notification bell. Without further ado, let's start the video. So, when I was coming to Ames Vivo my relatives and my other school friends told me that it's a national college, there will be intense ragging there. Don't cry and come back. That's what my friends told me. So I was also expecting intense ragging from the seniors. And when I came to the college, the seniors called everyone of us and they were explaining the rules that we need to follow as juniors. So that went well. They didn't harass us, they didn't torture us or anything. So then the time went on, there wasn't much ragging. All they did was just make us sing songs, dance, small, small stuff. That's what they did for ragging. Nothing very serious like I was expecting. So it was okay for me. Then from the next year onwards, from our juniors onwards, the first years are kept in a separate hostel. And no senior from any batch is allowed to go near the hostel even. So from the 2017 batch onwards, there was literally almost zero ragging. You can't call that ragging, it's interaction, right? So there is almost zero interaction with the juniors. So if you think ragging is a big issue, then just come to Ames Vivo There is no ragging in Ames Vivo Yeah, there'll be some interaction with the seniors. You'll have to wish all the seniors. That's all, nothing more. Now let's talk about the campus and the environment. As you would have seen in the intro video, our campus is one of the best looking campus among all the Ames. Even I would say, it looks even better than Ames Delhi maybe. Because the reason why many of us, many of us, my juniors and my seniors chose Ames Vonesia was because of the photo that they put in the website. Like in that photo, Ames looked like college from some other country. While all the other new Ames looked like similar, Ames Vonesia was standing out. That's one reason that we all chose Ames Vonesia. So if you look at our campus, there is lush greenery everywhere. And we have very less pollution because we are kind of away from the main road, like around two kilometers away from the main road. So there is not much traffic and this road just leads to our college. And there won't be any noise pollution or air pollution as such. It is very clean and there is not much dust also. So it is a very clean and green campus. And there are all the facilities in and around our campus only. Like there are small restaurants, grocery shop and all those things. And our campus is just eight kilometers away from the airport. And from the main highway, that is National Highway 16, it is just two kilometers. So it's pretty easy to travel from Ames to other places in and around Bovenesia. And if you want to go for long trips, that also. All the cab aggregators like Uber, Ola and everyone comes here. And Zomato, Swiggy, and when Uber Eats was there, Uber Eats also used to deliver at our campus. And if you are a person who loves animals, then there are a lot of dogs and cats inside the campus. You can go pet them whenever you want. I won't be talking about the sports facilities that we have inside the campus in this video. I'll talk about that in the next video. Now let's look at the food and hostel facility. We have two dining halls run by Yatri Bojan Private Limited. So when I first came to Ames Vanesha, the mess was not that great, I would say. It wasn't very hygienic or anything. But now, our mess is top-notch. It is very hygienic, very clean, and the transactions are seamless. So what do I mean by transactions are seamless? The thing is, we have a card which is issued by Yatri, and we can put money, we can recharge that card anytime we want, 
and whenever you go to take food from us you can just show that card there's a barcode they will scan you enter a pin and you can buy the food you don't have to carry money all the time and you don't have to think about getting change or anything you can just show this card and get the food and now during the covid times they are delivering to your room if you just message them they will deliver to your room and on top of this we have a 24 hour canteen in our hospital so if you have midnight cravings you can just go to our hospital and get the food then about the hostel facilities so in first year you will be put in a room with one more person and you will have to share the room with him for around a year once the freshers is over the juniors will be shifted to the hostel along with the seniors and they will be getting single room and above the toilet there will be three toilets and two bathrooms it's common one shared by 10 rooms and the bathrooms and toilets will be cleaned by the janitors every day morning and they will clean the outside of your room and if you want your room to be cleaned by them then you can just ask them they will come to your room and clean it you will have to pay some 20 to 50 rupees depending on how messy your room is and we have a common room in our hostel and you can play table tennis and things like that if you want to play indoor volley or basketball that also you can do here yeah we don't have a television in our hostel but we have television in each and every floor of our dining hall so when there is ipl or premier league you can just go to the dining hall and fight it out with your rivals from every batch and I forgot to say this, in internship you will be getting a bath attached room. So I have covered the basic hostel and food facilities available inside our campus. Now let's talk about the Bonesha city. So when I first came here, the Bonesha city wasn't that big. It was in a stage of development. It is still in a stage of development. We have a shopping mall just 3 kilometers away from our college. You have got Inox there and a lot of restaurants and a lot of shopping places in that mall and it's just three kilometers you can just walk if you want to that shopping mall and we have a very big shopping mall around 20 kilometers away from our college and don't be afraid that it is 20 kilometers because we have national highway 16 and you can just reach there in 30 minutes the first thing that amazed me when i came to bonisha was the size of the road the roads are so big and they are well maintained so it's very easy to travel in and around Bhubaneswar and even to the outskirts. The roads are well maintained. Like I told about our campus, Bhubaneswar city is also pretty green and clean. Other than the fact that there are a lot of cows on the road. And there are a lot of weekend getaways in Bhubaneswar. If you are a travel jungi, you are gonna love Odisha. Odisha has everything. Mountains, rivers, beaches, anything. Anything that you can think of, it's there in Odisha. So if you are a travel jungi, then this is the best place for you. And when we talk about the language, almost 80% of everyone in and around Bhuvaneshwar understands Hindi. But when you come to the hospital, there will be only 30% of the people who will be understanding Hindi. This is because like many of the patients who are coming to our college are from very distant places. There are people coming from Andhra and West Bengal also. So that's all for this video. In the next video, I'll be talking about academics and other co-curricular activities in Ames Bhuvanesha. So if you would like to see that, then subscribe to my channel and ring that notification bell so that you will get a notification whenever I am uploading that video. If you like this video, then smash that like button and comment why you chose Ames Bhuvanesha if you are already a student or why you would be choosing Ames Bhuvanesha in the comments. Bye, till we meet again.